Hi, friends. I missed you guys so much. It's been a while. I know. I know. Um, but anyways, what are you guys up to? What's going on? Wait, before I get into this video, I want to talk about these straps real quick because I know everybody's probably looking at them. Um, so right now I have a faja on. I'm about that faja life right now because I had my baby a week ago. And before I had my baby, I had set out so many like goals and things that I wanted to accomplish for myself and one of them was after having baby of course getting the body of my dreams the body that I've always wanted and I know it's going to take some time to get there but the first step to getting to the body of my dreams is wearing a faja and getting my body back to not even back to pre-pregnancy because it wasn't even all that I was sitting around 185 pounds um, and then the day before I had the baby, I was 201 pounds. So I gained a decent amount of weight, not too much. I cannot wait to get to pre-pregnancy weight, of course, because that's like, that's like the first, that's like a beginning step, right? But yeah, anyway, so yeah, this is just the Faka and of course my nursing bra. Um, but I feel like I look super like top heavy. And the reason for that is because obviously the Faka is like sucking me all in and like it has my body like... <sighs> like super like no i don't know how to explain it does that make sense and then my boobs look super huge which i'm not mad about my milk supply did come in so i'm loving it i'm not complaining at all i love 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 how my boobs look right now because i've always wanted big boobs and yeah tmi anyways um but yeah i'm the only one in my family that did not get blessed with big natural boobs um everybody else did my aunts my cousins um, my mom, my sister, and I'm the only one that didn't. So, Wee. so anyways, we're going to go really quickly to get some coffee. I have a few things I need to do around the house and we don't have coffee here. So I just wanted to go really quickly, pick up a cop, pick up a coffee at Starbucks and come back home, get some stuff done. Um, when I get back home, I will show you guys my to-do list of things I need to get done. It's not super special or like, wow, oh my gosh. But um, if you want to see me grab a coffee and see what's on my to-do list for today, Keep watching. I drive off um, I'm gonna show you guys what I got really quickly so I just got a vanilla iced coffee with um, half vanilla no classic and with half and half I always ask them for half vanilla just because I don't want my coffee super sweet like, and I also got a water so that I can make sure that I'm I drink water after I have my coffee hold on a second Alan <sighs> all right so as soon as I came home I ended up giving Olivia her injections, um, her lunch, and then, yeah, mom life. So, I'm going to show you guys my to-do list right here. Give me a second. Okay, so this is pretty much my to-do list. Um, so, these are my non-negotiables, things that have to get done. What's going on? Okay, yeah, so these are my non-negotiables, things that have to get done. So, the boys' schoolwork, we do that on the tablet diaper genie pretty much i bought the diaper genie um bags and i just have not inserted them in there um so i need to do that and then wash sheets my bed sheets so these are non-negotiables they will get done today and then this right here is my to-do list for the house so pretty much like my chores my chores if you will so I have laundry sweep and swiffer vacuum rugs dishes and edit the vlog just this vlog right here and then me time just kind of remind myself to take care of myself and not really stress about all this um and just kind of do this when it can get done it was hidden for a while it wasn't actually hidden it was just put away in my room um i stopped using it once the quarantine happened once the kids school was canceled and all that like i just stopped using it because everything was closed stopped writing things down um 
but now that but now that i have a newborn everybody has appointments olivia has appointments with her endo her endocrinologist um, this agenda is very handy and i need to keep it with me at all times to not forget anything because there's a lot of stuff i need to remember and i forget it all so yeah that's pretty much what we have to get done today um like i said it's nothing crazy it's nothing like oh my gosh like wow her days are intense like they've actually been decent i've been able to manage and keep up with the house so let me get a sip of my coffee and let's get some work done one thing down um i already started on one of my non-negotiables which was my sheets and i'm glad i started on them because i can already hear axel whining Hello. and olivia she's ready to get down Hi. you want to go lay down no you want to watch moana yeah okay let me clean you off and then we'll go watch moana okay you guys how precious. How gorgeous. So does he get lost? How gorgeous. You love him? Mm -hmm. He's so cute. Oh, I swear you guys, I think he has like the biggest hands. Oh my God, I'm so in love. I'm so obsessed. I just can't get enough of him. Such a cutie pie. All right. Hey, where are you going? Wake it. <laughs> oh my gosh. Don't start Wicked. <laughs> it's so weird, guys. I don't see a big old bonsai anymore. This is gonna, I was gonna say this is gonna take some getting used to, but it actually isn't because I actually enjoy it. So we just got these rugs. Um, I think this is like a five by six, no, a five by eight. I'm not too sure, but we ordered these rugs. I love it. That area is going to be like the little play area. I got two rugs. I got this rug and I got that one back there. That one's a three by three by four or three by five. I don't even know, honestly. I have to look back for reference. I have to look back at the papers. Um, but that's gonna be like the little play area. I just have to figure out how to decorate it. I just wanted to show y'all really quickly the rugs. Um, wash the sheets, down the couch, <laughs> um, wash laundry. So this is my baby girl. Can you tell them your name? Como te llamas? No. Are you writing your name? Girl, you know how to hold that pen real good. Sunday is Mother's Day. Whee! I was serious when I said that I am going to get to the body of my dreams um, this year. Oh, so of course there are going to be steps that I need to take um, and just trust the process and, but at the same time work hard towards my goals without stressing myself and overwhelming myself. I am going to also be documenting that. I do have pictures of um, my body after I gave birth to Axel. I'm gonna pretty much be documenting that because I wanna see it for myself. I know it's hard to tell by looking in the mirror, um, like the progress that you've been making because you see yourself every day. And of course, like your clothes will fit differently, but self to see like the start to finish. I know it's gonna take some time, like I said, but um, I look forward to it. And I also look forward to sharing with you guys because I think that's something that I've struggled with for all of my life is feeling good about myself, eating clean, being consistent, but also being realistic about food and not just like going cold turkey and because I can't do that. Like, honestly, I just can't. I'm not that type of person. I'm gonna be able to share that with you guys and share that journey. And 
and also i feel like that will keep me accountable like i'm sharing these things so it's like okay i, I need to show up i can't just talk the talk like i need to walk the walk too so i feel like it's gonna be fun i look forward to sharing all that with you guys um this is a start um because life with a newborn because life with four kids one of them being a newborn and one of them being a newly diagnosed type 1 diabetic is is a lot i'm not gonna lie but it's nothing that i cannot handle um i got it i just and then adding youtube on top of that um yeah it's a lot but i'm not stressing myself out i'm gonna do this because it's fun for me it's an outlet for me that's gonna be it for today's video you guys i hope you all enjoyed it i know it wasn't um crazy crazy stuff going on here i wanted to show you guys what my days look like sort of um with a new baby at home hope you guys enjoyed this video i need to finish up with the cleaning all right you guys i love you all take care and have a good one bye